Recently, we have seen increased terror, turmoil, and despair in Israel and Palestine. The shock, the pain, the grief from these events continues to reverberate across our community. In Howard County, we have many residents whose family, friends, neighbors, and loved ones are either visiting or residing in Palestine and Israel. A week after the brutal massacre, innocent Israeli and Americans are still held hostage and the devastating death toll in Palestine and Israel continues to climb. The unconscionable attacks on innocent people, including young people, babies, and the elderly, must be condemned in the strongest terms. This has been a period of immense grief as we join to mourn Palestinian, Israeli, and American lives lost to war in Israel and Gaza. With each day that passes, my heart goes out to every person who is suffering in the Middle East, and I pray for the safety of these innocent people. There is no home, no place, and no justification for terrorism and the killing of innocent human beings. As we feel our increased division in our community, let us be the guiding light for those who are hurting most, even as many of us hurt. Let us be the purveyors of peace, even as some of us feel fear and anger. Let us be our best selves for each other and encourage those around us to do the same, even as we may feel at times lost in our grief. It is times such as these where we begin to see hate reverberate in our community through anti-Semitism or Islamophobia. We have already seen an increase locally in anti-Semitic and anti-Muslim rhetoric. Now, Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. reminded us that darkness cannot drive out our darkness. Only light can do that. Hate cannot drive out hate. Only love can do that. During this time of despair, hurt, and anger, I encourage us all to show more compassion, love, and empathy to one another. I know that we are all hurting, but I am certain that we can stand together to affirm that any kind of violence and religious hatred is indefensible and will not be tolerated. Whether you're Muslim, Jewish, or any other religion, no matter who you love or your background, let us unite to foster a welcoming Howard County where people are safe and feel safe. Let us say, in word and deed, hate has no home here. I ask that we continue to pray for the safety of our family, friends, neighbors, and loved ones overseas and those who are seeing the repercussions here at home. God willing, we will one day achieve peace and justice for all. Thank you.